We are getting closer to Christmas, but it doesn't really feel like Christmas quite yet. No. But we do have some changes on the way though, right? We do. When do we get to <laughs> more seasonal tips? I guess? <laughs> it's actually going to cool down to where we should be. Okay. Probably not till this weekend, which for some of you is good. Maybe you have a round of golf planned tomorrow uh, or even on Friday. It's going to be a great couple of days to do it. There's a live look outside to Fayetteville. It's great outside. Sorry, Fayetteville. No record today like you set yesterday. But there's always tomorrow, which is a much better. We were slightly cooler today. Remember, we had a very weak front roll through yesterday afternoon, and that kind of cooled us off a little bit. That's why we only got, well, only got to 70 degrees today, which is still just three degrees shy of that record set back in 1982. Some of you probably want that 13 degrees that we had on this uh, morning of 1985. Meanwhile, in Fort Smith, also lit up uh, for the holidays out there, also 70 degrees, a little bit further away from their record of 77, also set back in 1982. Again, these look at our averages. 57 is where we should be, so 13 degrees above uh, average here. And these numbers are another 10 to 15 degrees above where we should be at this time of the evening. We should be flirting with the freezing mark in a lot of locations. Nothing like that. It's warm, and it's going to stay warm, possibly, according to the Climate Prediction Center, all of this deep uh, colors here indicate high confidence in above average temperatures for the entire month of December. And in our area, the darker, the higher the confidence. So very high confidence across most of Arkansas, even across northern parts of the state for a warm December. That does not mean we can't get bouts of cold air, but overall it most likely will be warm and possibly dry with uh, chances for below average precipitation also possible for December. Tomorrow that warm air continues to spill in. It will be 15, 20 to 25 degrees above average, which will flirt and challenge records uh, tomorrow. Tonight, nice and seasonable out there, cloud free again. Same thing waking up tomorrow morning. You can see by the afternoon, many locations like Fort Smith and Greenwood 76 by three o'clock tomorrow afternoon. That would be getting close to a record. And then we'll start to see clouds increase tomorrow night ahead of our next weather maker. That'll bring us some precipitation for the weekend, which you'll see here in a second. Here's a look at those lows tonight. 40s everywhere you look, very, very mild out there. Same thing for tomorrow's highs, a very, very warm day. Could somebody hit 80 possibly in southeast Oklahoma, but we'll have to see nothing. No 80s tomorrow, but just uh, 70s record of 75 at Drake Field tomorrow. We'll get to possibly 72, 73. Uh, like I said, we will certainly flirt with that record. Then the system comes in, bringing us uh, chances for shower Saturday and Sunday before more seasonable temperatures open up next week. Same thing in the River Valley, 75 tomorrow record is 78. We will get tantalizingly close, but we'll have to see Darby will have the latest tomorrow. Stay with us much more after the break.